right, thank you for tuning in to another episode of Three Quick Questions with Ian M. I'm Ian M. My guest today is Mr. Bud. If you haven't heard him, they're a great band. They're bringing punk back to its original days. I cannot say enough about them. Uh, can you guys introduce yourself? Just PJ over here. He's the man, man. He's trying to remain semi anonymous. Well, we're going to keep you out. Now, my first question for you is I heard through the grapevine that you were in the ball. All the. What's happening in Washington? And with everything going on today, what is your opinion of what's going on with America? How can we fix it? Man, a lot of people aren't going to like this, but my opinion is the first thing you can do to fix America is don't vote for anyone. I used to be an avid voter. I preached voting. I'm the first person, the last election, I was the first person down at the polling place. I certified the uh, polling place, the ballot box. You know, you got to fill out all these papers, blah, 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 blah. blah. And uh, I voted for Obama. But, you know, I'd already been formulating this point of view, and I realized over time that the system is rigged. No matter who you vote for, you're voting for the same person. It's like two parties. You got the you don't get shoot party and the throw the dog a bone party. But they all work for the same people. Don't vote for anyone. Protest. March on Washington. Strike. Shut everything down. Shut it down. Get rid of everybody in office and rewrite the election laws. Get rid of big money. Until you get rid of the corruption, no, you will never have a true democracy. It's fucking it's bullshit. They lie to you. The media like is owned by big corporations that support all the big money in Washington. It's a joke. Yeah! Awesome. Piss and blood! Are you done yet? No, no, no. Thank you. Thank you. I was like, no. And now my second question for you guys after all that is, I hear you guys have a new CD coming out. So yes. Can you tell us about it? Our new CD is called FTW. We already mixed it once. We didn't like the mix. So it's being remixed again. The producer is Jeff Nowesky. In the past, he's produced uh, Smashing Pumpkins, Red Hot Chili Peppers. Uh, uh, he's done Hole, Jimmy Cliff. He's worked with Motorhead, Jimmy Page, and that's our producer, uh, Danny Dean from the band Anti. Uh, we recorded at his studio, Old Travis West. And uh, remixing and mastering is a process. Where can people go to get a hold of you guys or to find out about when your album's being released or what you're up to? Pissandblood.com. 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 Hit us up on Facebook and, and friend us and tell us that you like us. Or tell us that you hate us. We don't give a fuck either way. Just, we want to hear from your own fuck. Well, thank you for joining us. I appreciate you guys being my guest. I uh, cannot say enough about this band. You will be hearing from them for years to come. And once again, Ron, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And once again, once again, thank you for watching Three Quick Questions with the I gave the guys all a chance to talk over here. I'm going to throw in a bonus question. Anything you guys would like to say? Pissandblood.com. Please support your local artists. Go out and see bands like Piss and Blood. They really appreciate when you support them. Go out. If there is no music scene or any scene around you, go out and create one. Find the band, throw a concert, do something. Thank you again for watching this edition of Three Quick Questions. A little rowdy, but <laughs> wouldn't have it any other way with four great guys like this. Piss and Blood. Check them out. Pissandblood.com, Piss and Blood on Facebook. Thank you very much, and we're out.
like to fucking hang out.